From two identical twins born two years apart in the UK to a little South African girl who looks much older than her mother, here are some of the most unusual children and babies in the world. Let's get started. Callie and Carter Torres are twin little girls who now live in the state of Utah, USA. Together, they like to do a lot of things like play, talk about everything and anything, and much more. This seems quite normal for two twin sisters. However, these two girls are not like other twins. In fact, Callie and Carter are Siamese twins, Omphalo Isiopagus to be more precise. The two girls are indeed connected by the stomach and they share the same pelvis and the same pair of legs. The case of these two little twins was diagnosed during the pregnancy of their mother, Chelsea, who admits that she did not want to have an abortion, despite the advice of the doctors. Moreover, she would even refuse to make her daughters undergo a surgical operation in order to separate them. On the other hand, although their case may seem strange to you, the two little girls seem to adapt very well to their situation. Indeed, they have learned to live close to each other and have a good time together, like when they talk to each other. With time, they even learned to crawl together, and they would even be able to walk nowadays. A challenge taken up for the two Siamese twins, which is, however, worth to them to attract the curious glances of the people, looks that hurt according to their mother. But you could say that Callie and Carter don't even realize it, since they don't yet realize that they are different from other girls. On the other hand, their mother strongly believes that her daughters will be able to thrive as they are, even if they are never separated. And then with their pretty faces which make us crack, they become true small stars of the internet. Elise Tan Roberts is a little English girl born to a Nigerian father and an English Malaysian mother. Like all other children of her age, Elise only aspires to play and perhaps dreams of looking like one of those cartoon princesses and even having a big dollhouse in her room. Everything of an ordinary little girl, except that this little girl is not a child like the others. In fact, Elise is a very smart child, too smart in fact, and she surpasses the other toddlers with her very high IQ which reaches Brace yourself, 156. Yes, an IQ of 156 at only two years and four months old, which is only four points less than the famous Albert Einstein. Imagine that at five months, the little girl was already pronouncing her first word. And that's not all. At eight months old, she was already learning to walk, and two months later, she could run. But Elise proved that she also had other hidden talents, such as counting to 10 at 16 months, speaking foreign languages, revealing her knowledge of geography or geometry, and much more, never seen before. In fact, thanks to her extraordinary abilities, this gifted girl, who has been called the smartest child in Britain, has become the youngest member of the Mensa Association. In case you don't know, this international association, which was founded in Oxford, includes 2% of the most intelligent people. Elise has a bright future ahead of her. However, not everything in life is rosy, because as special as she is, this adorable little girl is already experiencing a kind of media pressure. And according to some people's opinion, she could one day experience a deep sense of failure. But the future will tell because at the moment, the girl is enjoying life to the fullest and is not worried about the coming years. She is like a normal girl as her parents wish. However, it should be said that this child who enjoys a great reputation in Great Britain is now the pride of her country. Do you like this video? Then do not forget to put a like, to subscribe to the channel, and to activate the bell to receive all the notifications and not miss anything of our next publications. Let's continue. Elisa McCann is a seemingly normal and healthy little girl. Nothing seems to affect her, yet when she tries to do anything, such as holding her parents' hand, she suffers a severe pain. This may sound like an exaggeration, but in reality, Elisa has very fragile skin. Elisa has a skin disease called Epidermolysis bullosa recessiva, or EBDR. This rare genetic skin disease, which consists of the appearance of bubbles on the skin and mucous membranes, causes painful lesions as well as wounds that are at risk of becoming infected. Sometimes, this disease can be fatal if not treated properly. Fortunately, this is not the case for little Elise, who has been treated by an American doctor in the state of Minnesota, USA. This treatment uses hematopoietic stem cells to treat this type of disorder. In order to do this, the girl underwent a bone marrow transplant, the donor of which was none other than her sister. Thanks to this doctor's treatment, little Elisa's health has improved significantly. Her skin has become less fragile, and the little girl can now walk normally and even hold her parents' hands. However, it would take some time because the treatment could be long, so little Elisa would have to be very, very patient. But this will be a bad memory for her in the next few years. In fact, thanks to the treatment, little Elisa's life has clearly changed, and for the better. Oliver and Isaac are two English twin brothers from the city of Leicester, two identical twins to be more precise. 
Ah, so that means they are very similar and always want to do things together or dream of living together and being inseparable forever. However, it may seem strange to you that Oliver and Isaac are not twins like the others. Why is that? Well, because these two brothers were born two years apart. No, this is not a joke, but a reality. Even their day and year of birth are different, yet these two little boys are considered identical twins. Well, technically, much to the astonishment of everyone who has seen them or heard about their very special story. However, there is a good explanation for this unusual case. Indeed, Rachel and Richard Best, the parents of the twins, had tested an in vitro fertilization where they had kept all the embryos. So, two years after Oliver was born first, Rachel and Richard had a new child from the same IVF. This means that both babies were born from the same batch of embryos and therefore could be considered as identical twins. For the moment, the big twin and the little twin, as their moms call them, don't realize yet the particularity of their case and are content to play together, having a lot of fun and spending childhood moments that they won't soon forget. However, if one day they learn that they are twin brothers, they might feel a great disappointment when they discover that they are not twins like the others. But maybe in a few years, everything will be back to normal, and the two brothers will end up looking like each other and will consider themselves as identical twins, despite their age difference. Yes, it has to be said, but the story of Oliver and Isaac never ceases to amaze. Unusual, but true. Nikita Sharma is a happy Indian mother of Prayan, a little boy who is now four years old. After the birth of her son and while she wanted to breastfeed him, this mother immediately noticed something abnormal in the newborn's mouth. Nikita called the doctor who examined the child. That's how she learned that her son had teeth. In fact, he had not only one tooth, as it could happen, but seven whole teeth that had developed in his lower gum. The mother was amazed, especially since she had to be separated from her child because he had to be transferred to an intensive care unit because of an infection. In addition, he had to undergo two surgeries to remove all those bulky teeth that were a real danger to him. But fortunately for this mom, things soon returned to normal because once he got rid of his teeth, Prayan was no longer in danger of swallowing a tooth and choking on it. Phew! You can imagine the relief Nikita must have felt at that moment. But it changed the life of this Indian mother forever. And how? Nikita was now considered the mother of a baby unlike any other. This young mother you see now lives in South Africa. When she gave birth to her daughter and as she approached her baby to get to know her better, she discovered something extremely incredible. Her daughter was not normal like other children. According to this mother, the baby was not crying and was breathing through her ribs. Also, the little girl had wrinkled skin, her hands were deformed, and she looked very old. An old baby? Yes, just like in the movie The Curious Case of Benjamin Button, which tells the story of a child born old. Unfortunately, this story was almost real for this little girl. After consulting with doctors, this young mother eventually found out that her daughter had hutchinson guilford syndrome, or progeria, an extremely rare genetic disorder that affects children and makes them look older in their early years. She reportedly learned that the disorder, which affects fewer than 200 children worldwide, is also believed to cause serious cardiovascular complications in sufferers and even premature death. You can imagine the shock this young mother must have felt when she heard this news. Even worse, she had to put up with tasteless reactions and unhealthy comments from some people who did not hesitate to make fun of her daughter who looked older than her after her photos were posted online. Sure, it hurt her a lot at first, but this mom wouldn't even mind nowadays and certainly has to take care of her child because all that matters to her is that her little girl can live as normal a life as possible. Anyway, with all this story, this young South African mom ended up making the buzz, despite herself. Grayson Smith, an American boy living in Alabama, is the youngest of four children. This child loves life and holds on tightly to it despite the difficulties he faces all the time. Grayson is a little boy who suffers from a unique genetic disease. When he was born, Grayson had deformities that had never been diagnosed in any other child. The boy's skull was deformed and pitted and his eyes were swollen. In addition, the child was blind and deaf and had heart problems and breathing difficulties. And yet, the doctors would have suspected nothing throughout the pregnancy. Grayson had to undergo at least 36 surgeries that finally allowed him to overcome almost all the problems he was suffering from. Indeed, thanks to all these operations, some of which were particularly delicate, the little boy regained his sight and hearing, and his skull was not as deformed as before. Yes, Grayson managed to defy the doctor's prognosis that he would not live more than three or four years. A true miracle. But of course, it must have been long and painful for little Grayson. However, his condition has improved visibly, and everything leads us to believe that he will lead a good life in the future. Thanks to his unique story, the miraculous little boy has become famous. 
In fact, Grayson Smith now lends his name to a new medically defined syndrome, Grayson syndrome. You've just discovered some babies that are not like the others. Tell me, which of these children surprised you or shocked you the most? Do you know of any other children who are as special as these that are not on this list? Leave your answers and impressions in the comments. And as always, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video.